Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the first, okay? So keep in mind that the timing is fluid and not every reading is for you, okay? So that means that not every reading is for you. <laughs> Anyhow, what do we have for a message today? What do we have for a message today? The devil reversed in the six of swords. So the devil reversed is breaking free from a toxic, unhealthy situation and moving on. So somebody is moving on from something that they have been tied to. They are severing ties. They have been in some sort of disaster, perhaps, you know, or in some sort of troubled situation where there was a lot of waves. There was a lot of... Uh, difficulties they may have gotten into it for materialistic reasons or because it was lust or it was instant gratification or whatever it is but this is breaking free so somebody is breaking free removing themselves from a toxic situation going to a better place traveling to a new destination uh, willing to uh, you know ride the waves away from this situation that is very very unhealthy I mean, that devil reversed is freedom, right? It is freedom from some sort of entrapment. Uh, somebody is taking a ride by the looks of things. Moving on. Moving away from something that is not healthy. Ace of Pentacles. We've got a golden opportunity here. This is manifestation. This is a windfall. It is a new investment. It's a new business opportunity. It is uh, a gift. A golden opportunity for long-term stability, success. Headed towards success. Headed towards something permanent and long-term. This is huge. This is a huge opportunity. It's right next to the Six of Swords. So, and sixes are the taking a journey towards balance and harmony. Not only is it dra traveling towards balance and harmony and peace and serenity, it's traveling towards long-term permanent abundance. Okay, that is a huge opportunity for abundance. This is something you can hold on to. This is something that you can take to the bank. This is a gift. This is this is this is something that. Uh, you can have for a very, very long time. It's huge. This is a huge opportunity. It's huge. Financial stability is what it is. Breaking free from a toxic situation that was based on, well, lies or delusion or instant gratification, you know, materialism maybe, lust. Ah, King of Cups reversed. So the King of Cups reversed is emotionally withdrawn, withdrawing emotionally, shutting down emotion, shutting down communication, uh, not in love with this toxic situation anymore. We got somebody who's not in love with this, with this toxic uh, situation. Um, Ooh, and it's interesting. This is going right, right underneath the Six of Swords. Four of Wands, happiness, reunion, commitment, uh, new foundation, getting together, having fun, partying. Somebody is headed towards a new commitment. Maybe even somebody they're going to marry. I mean, that's a marriage card, it's a commitment card, an engagement perhaps, headed towards happiness, a lot of happiness, a reunion. I think we have somebody here that is headed towards a reunion with somebody that is stable, solid, secure. There is going to be a get together, traveling traveling towards something I see I feel like there's an upcoming get together
two of wands upright two of wands is, is a decision do I stay or do I go? Do we have somebody here that has been at that crossroads. It's like they've seen the light. They're going down another path. The grass is greener over there. I'm going towards that green grass. I'm going towards the light. Stepping into unknown territory. So this is a spur of the moment decision. The door is wide open. So we got somebody here that is going through a new doorway. And it's going to be, I mean, that four of wands is happiness something solid, something real, taking the opportunity, making the decision. Moving, moving on from a dark situation into a light situation. The devil is darkness in reverse or upright, you know, it's, uh, but it's headed towards the light. I mean, you see the light coming through, going through a new doorway where there's light, there's beauty. This is, I mean, there's warmth there. We got somebody here that is, is uh, it's just too beautiful to not go in that direction. It really is. Ooh, three of swords reversed. And the three of swords reversed is on the path to recovery, leaving the past behind. And the two of wands is about leaving the past behind as well. Somebody is leaving something behind that has caused them a lot of heartache. It's caused them a lot of suffering. This is the end of suffering. They're on the path to recovery. Absolutely. This is a healing light. It is a healing energy. It is something real. It is something solid. It's something you can hang on to. It brings extreme happiness. Leaving the past hurts behind. Ooh, six of cups. I know there's there's some sort of reunion here. I don't know if it's a soulmate reunion because the four of wands resembles soulmates and so doesn't the six of cups. We may have two soulmates that are coming together in the future. There's also nostalgia here, memories, memories of love, reawakening memories of love. You know, there could be there could be a new love here that is reawakening somebody's memories of love, making them remember what love is supposed to feel like. There could also be some sadness with the Three of Swords. Memories, a lot of memories with that Six of Cups. But it looks like there's, I don't know, there's some sort of happiness here as well. Leaving behind the trouble, going to a better place, some place that is stable and solid and secure, building a foundation, a solid foundation, because the Ace of Pentacles next to the Four of Wands, that is a solid foundation, something solid, something real, something stable where there's a lot of light, where there's a lot of happiness. I feel like we have like some sort of reunion here between soulmates. And this could be somebody from a past life because Six of Cups is a past. This could be a past life reunion. Action is being taken. Somebody is finding their confidence and their determination to go, you know, they're going. And I feel like they're being, I feel like there's uh, help. There's help. There's like, I almost feel like they, like there's help arriving. Headed towards a get together or a reunion or a partnership where there's light, where there's abundance and happiness. Six of Cups is a reunion. We have a reunion here between soulmates. But it comes after a separation with that devil reverse. That is breaking free from a toxic situation that somebody has been bound to because of all the wrong reasons. The devil is all the wrong reasons, right? It is. 
Somebody was bound to something for all the wrong reasons. Now that they are finding their courage to break free, they're going to be reuniting with a soulmate of some sort. There is a soulmate here. Ooh, the star card. Star card is heaven sent. It is protection. It is a wish being granted. It is a wish being fulfilled. This is what you asked for. This is a dream come true. This is a new purpose. It is a renewal. It's a renewal. We do have a renewal here. We have a happy ending. We definitely have a happy ending here headed towards wish fulfillment. We got somebody here that is headed towards wish fulfillment. This is also famous as well. So I'm not sure if we have somebody here that is famous that is, uh, you know, a star, a star, get it, a star, shining. This is a new purpose. We have a we have a wish. Somebody is headed towards their wish. They're headed towards what they asked for. They are. Where there's nothing to be ashamed of either. You know, you get to be yourself. You can be yourself completely, wholeheartedly, you know. So anyway. I, and there's forgiveness here as well with the three of swords reversed. There's forgiveness. Somebody is moving. They're moving on from a dark situation into a much better one. <laughs> Should I keep going? Might as well, right? Manifested. Somebody manifested this with that Ace of Pentacles. The answer is yes, they will be accepted. They were, are going to be accepted by this soulmate, of whoever it is. Anyhow, um, stepping into the light, stepping into the future. Leaving the past hurts behind. In their glory. Somebody's going to be right in their friggin' glory. Ooh, tower reverse. This is a permanent change. Building a new foundation. Somebody's, somebody has had a false foundation crumble. Because they have, they have something here that is a perfect match, obviously. Building a new foundation. Somebody's going to be building a new foundation from scratch. Can't stop the faces. Page of Cups. Page of Cups. That's an offer of love. That is Cupid. You know, that's Cupid uh, bringing somebody an opportunity for love. Okay, this is a heartfelt message, expression of feelings, um, an opportunity for love here. And it's, this, is, this is a an offer of love, an invite, a message. Somebody is going to be receiving a message that uh, makes them happy, put it that way. I feel like we have a reunion here. I mean, what more can I say? This is messages of love, flirting, having fun, getting together. I do see having fun. You know, with that four of wands, we could have somebody here that, that you know, they're going, I don't know if they're going out together or something like that. Headed towards a union that is perfect put it that way that's gonna last this is something that is solid I mean it's it is it is absolutely solid it's not false but they've been in a false contract they've been in a false sense of security and now they're on the path to recovery where they're about to find their friggin bliss all right I'll let you go
Anyway, it looks really good, doesn't it? So we got a new opportunity here. It's a golden opportunity. Somebody is stepping into, uh, you know, they're stepping over the edge. They are on the path to recovery. They're building a new foundation after one has crumbled. It crumbled for a reason. There's Their, uh, their memories of love are going to be reawakened. This is an abundance of love. It really is. So this is for you. Congratulations. Good luck.